It's not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos, I'll put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. I'm going to get a false narrative. The markets are going to make bad trading decisions. Listen, um, some people have asked me some questions about do I invest in dividend stocks, what dividend plays I was in. And um, once again, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell any stock. That's not what I'm telling you. All I'm doing is sharing what I have in my portfolio, in my dividend portfolio, okay? And once again, you need to do your own research, do your own DD, and determine if you want to be in these dividend plays, okay? But you can Google any stock, find out their dividend date, with the last time they paid a dividend. It's not hard to get this information. This information is readily available. All you have to do is a little bit of research. But in my portfolio, these are the dividend stocks that, that I have. And once again, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell these stocks. I'm just telling you what dividend stocks I have. The first one is O, which is a realty stock. The last dividend it paid was like 25 cents a share. Then you had MAIN, which is Mainstream Capital, and that paid about 22 cents a share. Then you had XOM, which is Exxon, you know, the, the oil company, and that was 91 cents a share. And then we had VTI, which is Vanguard Total ETF, and that, that paid about 78 cents a share. Then you had OXY, which is Occidental Petroleum, and that's the one that, you know, that Warren Buffett loves. That's paying like 18 cents a share. And then SAVE, which is Spirit Airlines, everybody knows, you know, I use Spirit a lot. A lot of people don't like to use it because they think it's a cheap airlines, but I get a good bang for my buck. So being that I use it so much, of course, I had to have Spirit shares. That's only logical. That pays 10 cents a share. And then I had some, some PFE, which is Pfizer, and that was 39 cents a share. And then Apple, of course, which pays 23 cents a share. Of course, I have an Apple iPhone. So, of course, I'm going to have Apple. And then Rocket Mortgage, RKT, that was paying like $1.11 a share. So, that's what it is. Those are the stocks that I have in the, my dividend portfolio. Once again, I'm going to tell you to buy, hold, or sell. But I think dividend plays is like passive income without you having to really do anything. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think dividend dividend stocks are a good way for us to make passive income? Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.